here. Thank you for being back. This is the birthday readings. I am so, so happy last week um, has finally come to an end. Um, this week is going to be um, a fire week. I love this week because it's a week of um, um, positive energies. And this week is a week for you birthday people. And it is the changing of the guards. And um, when I, I say the changing of the guards, this means that um, this wonderful new experience is about to come in your lives. Okay. So um, this is a fabulous because it is um, uh, the energy of uh, um, the cancers going in. Um, the layers, okay. The cancer is going in the layers, and there is a lot of stuff that is going to be happening, okay. There's really a lot of stuff. The week begins from the 16th of um, week begins from the 16th of July until the 22nd of July. So what do we understand from this? This is the end. This is the last week of the Cancerian's birthday. Oh my God, this is so wonderful. So you Cancerians, I love this for you guys because you're ending this week in a positive note. Um, um, you know, for you birthday people, the people who are having birthday from the 16th until the 22nd, Kudos to you guys. Um, it's going to be a good year. It is the year of the emperor. Here from the emperor is a lot of achievement. Um, a lot of new stability in your life. A lot of passion. I like the passion and the drive because the um, energy of the emperor. And this is the energy that you will receive to go through the entire year you cancer. So this is going to be wonderful and profoundly um, very impressive, I should say, because as you look at the energies uh, um, and in every, every week, um, not to worry, because in every, every week, someone has a spiritual, um, some people have to go through a spiritual definition of their lives okay oh, obviously so um not to worry about what is going on with you at this moment because things is about to change things is about to change okay so um god whatever is going on um not to worry about what is going on because um things are about to change okay so um, be aware and aligned with this energy that things, um, basically are about to change for you guys. Okay. Cause really it is, um, a year of changing that is coming in. So let's go ahead and look and see. I'm sorry. My cards are, are shifted. I know when people, um, align with my cards because my cards are always shifted. Okay. So happy birthday um, for all you Cancers um, who are having birthday from the 16th until um, the 22nd. The week is a fire week and so it's not really the week energy for you guys. It is really the year energies for you guys, okay? This year is going to be a wonderful year because a lot of changes, a lot of movement, a lot of changes, a lot of people who are going to be moving is a lot of inner strength. A lot of you have to find inner strength. Um, there is um, some people are having inner strength. Some people are looking for inner knowledge and wisdom. Um, the wheel of fortune is turning in your favor. If there was a legal suit um, for some of you, um, this is going to be a time when you're going to be um, um, looking for yourself because this energy is in the reverse, but it's supposed to be in the upright position okay because it is the general um birthday readings for the year so let's move in and see what is happening um for the people on the 16th 
17, 18, 19, <laughs> 20th, 21st, 22nd. So, outcomes is going to be a lot of opportunities are going to be coming your way. Just basically a lot of opportunities are going to be coming your way. Okay? It's as if there is a shift of consciousness that is going to be happening and a lot of opportunities are going to be coming your way. I'm basically loving this because what I'm seeing is uh, money, help, Happiness is coming in for a lot of you guys. Money, help, and happiness is coming in for a lot of you guys. A lot of you are going to be looking within to find the um, the inner child and to find yourself and the inner child within you, okay? So let's see um, what else is going to be coming out and then we're going to go one by one to look at this energy because this year for you guys is going to be good okay um message coming help is coming from overseas luck a whole lot of you guys are going to be having luck and the last thing okay so a lot of you are going to be moving houses a lot of you um there we go a lot of you are going to be moving houses in this year okay so from now from now to um your next birthday in 2019 um some of you are going to be moving houses um some of you are going to be moving houses but some of you are also going to be aligned with the energies of positive situation going on in your life. Um, a lot of opportunities are coming your way. Um, a lot of positive situations are going to be coming your way. And what is going to be happening is that um, you are going to be finding out that your life is about to change like in just wonderful, wonderful experience and wonderful ways. Okay. As we look at the energy of um, um, the people who were born on the 16th of July, um, the energy with the people who were born on the 16th of July, you can see um, this is basically um, a, a step forward, changes, movement, um, finding the magic in your life. And there is going to be a lot of movement going forward because this is a transformation and whatever this energy comes up with the debt is that you have found a way to move forward in life it's a positive um it's not a, an, an energy of debt because it has nothing to do with anyone it is the energy of the magician it's as if um you have found what it is uh, um, to move you forward in a positive way and this is what is going to be happening for you guys and this is good so for the people who were born on the 16th there's a lot of going to be a lot of victory and success movement passion you moving in the right direction you moving forward in your life in positive way and by doing this what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring basically is that you're going to be seeing endings but positive new beginnings and these endings and positive new beginnings are going to bring bring um positive situation in your life okay as we move on to the people who were born on the 17th it's a year of um finding inner strength okay um but this um inner strength is going to be good because it's as if um you're going to be allotted a lot of money it's as if you're going to be receiving the message uh, for a lot of money. If you look at this, you can see this lady trying to figure out um, how is she going to steal the beast inside. And the beast inside could be, um, oh, I've got money. So how am I going to 
um, not use everything up and it can be that because there is a message that is coming okay so the infinity and um, uh, for some people it depends on what sort of an energy vibration is it depends on um, are you someone who is basically um, fighting for nothing or fighting for something and this is going to be good because this is going to give you a push um, money is going to be coming to you it's no question as 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 if uh, the blockage that was there is now going to be lifted money is going to be coming to you as you look at the people who were born under 18 you have the energy of the hermit the energy of the hermit is the situation where you're going within to find in a peace to find in a guidance to find in a strength and by doing that because water is actually in the ship here and help is coming in so by going within you're going to be blessed with information that is going to be helping you basically in the future and this is good because um, you're going in to connect to your um, spirit guides and angels and connect in a positive way and um, you are going to be seeing that your life is going to be changing because you're going to be uh, connecting um, you're going to be looking for inner wisdom and guidance and this when inner wisdom and guidance is going to come out in um, surprising ways because it's going to guide you um, to make um, steps and make changes in your life and by doing that you are going to be seeing how positive and a good certain aspect of your life is going to be changing and in a positive way okay so this is um, really positive as we look at the people who were born on the 19th um, 19th you have the wheel of fortune with the nine of cups and with the clothes and um, the clothes is always luck it's gonna be here a very very lucky here in love not only in love but in your financial situation um, some of your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through a lot of marriages a lot of um, uh, receiving awards um, is going to be coming up for some people um, aligning yourself with the right people at the right situation is as, 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 as if if you were having a really really um, horrible time um, what is going to be happening is that uh, that is going to be moving away from you and remember it depends on what you give out because if you um, if you're always negative and always working against others that is what is going to be um, coming back to you because your energies your um, luck and that sort of a thing is going to be um, that that is exactly what you give out is what you receive so if you are someone who is always, you know, hoping and wishing and helping other people and that sort of thing, all of a sudden luck is going to be coming in your life. All of a sudden things that you are wishing and open for, it, your wishes are going to be granted because uh, the Wheel of Fortune is going to bring this to you. So cuddles to you, um, uh, you Cancers who were born on the 19th of July. It's going to be a wonderful, positive, positive, positive congratulations. This year 2018 because you're about to start the year 2018 because you have just ended after your birthday um, you are going to begin the new year of 2018 so you all have been vibrating in the energy of 2017 okay then as we move forward we are going to be looking at uh, um, the people who were born under 20th now sip of coffee sorry okay if you people had a, um, a situation with someone who was an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra this is the year where you are going to be um, ending the situation you're going to be um, victoriously coming out of the situation okay if you had to deal in the past with someone who is an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra? You're handling this. You are saying to yourself in this year, "I am standing up, and I'm you. I'm standing up, and I'm going to use the sword of truth to release this situation and this person from um, 
who I am. So it could be you're married to an Aquarius, Gemini or Libra, whether you're a man or a woman, and you're going to decide, hell no, you are out of my life. I'm ending this relationship. I'm looking for something much better. This is my life and I'm going to be moving forward in my life. Okay. So this is basically what you're going to be doing and ending a situation and whoever this person was, they were, um, they were basically, um, um, they were basically um, hanging on to you and sucking your energy. And this was someone who was entering your house. This was someone who you're living with um, because I'm receiving the energy of your partners and that sort of a thing. And it was someone who was just stealing from you also, which some of you Cancers are going to be finding out, especially if your birthday is on the 20th of July you're going to be finding this out and you're going to bring an end to this situation. As we look at the people who were born on the um, 21st of July, um, it's going to be a year where there is a lot of karmatic situation in the family. A lot of conflicts, a lot of conflicts. It is a year that you have to find inner strength, inner strength to deal with family and um, a situation that has to do with family. You are going to be standing your grounds and learn to stand your grounds to say, uh, no, this is where it ends and I'm not really going to be um, moving forward in this sort of a situation. You're going to be ending situations with family. It's going to be a year where family, the energy of family is just going to be taking over your life. Okay. And a lot of conflicts and you're going to think, okay, I'm ending this, whatever it is, I'm bringing an end to this situation. As we move forward and we look at the people on the 22nd now, For the energy of the people on the 22nd. Um, if you have a business, this business could be coming to an end. There, there, um, yeah. If you have a management position, it could be coming to an end in this year also. In work, career, and business is not a positive year. It's not a positive year. Sorry, it's as if some of you were connected, um, or some of you have done um, some on call for on craving things in the past, and it's coming back to bite you. So if we were born on the 22nd, which is a double energy and you're working with double energy, dual energies, and you're in a management position or you have a business, it's not going to be a good year for you. Um, the wheel of fortune is going to bring you um, the energy of the towel, which is going to be ending things in your life. Only, only if you have a business or um, only if you have a business or and you are in a management position, okay? So if you have a business in your man management position, um, the universe is going to end, bring your life to the ground, crumble down, and you have to rebuild. For the rest of the people, it's going to be wonderful for the men um, in this year because um, you're going to become father's um, information, it's a year where a lot of you are going to be receiving information. Now, this information that you're receiving, some of you could be writing a book also. Um, some of you could be writing a book, but some of you are receiving information. Some of you could be receiving information from IO apps. I 
and be aware for the information that you're receiving because when the energy of the books come is that um it could be secrets um but yet still it could be information that is about to enter your life that you weren't aware of and this information could be helping you out in the future um they're going to be aligning you um and helping you to understand its knowledge secrets the unknown some of you could be going back um to study um and this is going to be good for some of you um in relationships um be discreet some of you are going to be running away with someone <laughs> okay um keep something quiet whatever it is keep um um something quiet okay um things that is not out is going to be coming out okay um 16 ah. some of you are going to be studying astrologue And some cartomancy is here. Cartomancy is um, things that you have been basically um, realizing that was happening, whatever the situation is or whatever that was transpiring, okay? But overall, as I look at your year for mo most of you guys, and you know, the energy with the emperor is always, um, because as I said to you guys, it's, it's a year where a lot, it's a year where a lot of situation is going to be, um, happening, a lot of transition, a lot of positive energies. Okay. Um, whatever, um, that was stolen from you, whatever that was not, um, whatever that was stolen from you, whatever, um, that was, um, taken without thing there, it, it's going to be, um, positive because what is going to be happening is that you are going to be receiving positive news. Okay. A whole lot of you have been waiting for information. If you have been waiting for information, waiting for, um, information from overseas and that sort of a thing. Um, some of you are going to be, um, receiving that. Let's say you apply, um, for something overseas or in another state or that sort of a thing. It's going to be happening for you. It's going to be good. Help is going to be coming in. Um, for the people who are born on the 18, this is actually, um, a good sign because it's as if help is going to come in from overseas for you guys, especially the people who were born on the 18th of July. A lot of help is going to be coming in from overseas for you guys. There's help that is going to be coming in. Um, however way this help is going to come in, it could be people coming in, it could be messages, it could be um, information coming at you, and this is going to be um, extremely um, good because whatever the information that you're um, receiving from overseas is going to be in a positive way. Okay. Some of you are going to be traveling long distance. The people who are born on the 18th, because this is, um, thing, uh, um, information that is coming long distance trip and that sort of a thing. Um, it's going to be happening for you guys, but it's going to be a happy journey. It's going to be something that you have been looking forward to, um, do. So some of you are going to be traveling. Um, some of you can, could be gambling and some of you could be going on short journeys, but it's going to be, um, you know, nice short journeys. Um, for the people who, and, and, and this is for the people on, um, on the 18, I don't know why I'm looking at the people on the 18, but I was just guided to, um, for that. Um, long, term relationships wait for the right one okay so don't jump in any relationship at this moment wait for the right person okay um long-term relationship wait for the right one okay leaving some of you could be leaving someone or a loved one 
um, could be leaving you behind okay and this is for the people on the 17th I don't know the 18th I don't know why I'm receiving this message some of you um, some of you could be also um, meeting someone from another country um, who is far away and far overseas this could be um, what is transpiring um, with you guys also okay um, um, so and some of you might um, uh, you know face um, uncertainty journey um, cancel trip and that sort of a thing but not to worry um, it's the retro breeds that are going to be coming in okay um I, I'm sorry I'm kind of working reverse um, for the people who were born in the 17 um, that is a positive um, situation where um, information good news if you're studying um, your study you're going to be finishing your study because um, um, some of you are going to be receiving um, uh, email news um, rebound um, you know there could be uh, information about blockage coming up something is on its way and that could be money um, a lot of you could be receiving that in relationships love letters um, a letter about friendship is going to be coming in um, some of you could be receiving a position um, and a good position um, so and some of you could be waiting for um, very personal messages to come in and um, you know they are going to be coming in good news good information um, yeah good news good information is going to be coming in um, messages that makes you feel happy so it's a wonderful year um, even though you're trying to find the inner strength and guidance okay well the people who were born under 16 I'm working back ways I'm so sorry um, whatever that was happening where people were using their wit and people were trying um, to calm you down or you were doing the same thing to people this is going to come to an end okay it's an ending of situation okay um, some of you were dealing with someone who were um, um, taking things from you and this is going to be ended as you look you see um, the end of the coffin with the, the, um, the rats okay whatever situation um, legalities and that sort of a thing that has um, been going on um, it's going to affect a lot of you and uh, um, most of you are going to stand up against whatever injustice okay um, most of you are going to stand up against whatever injustice because um, you know you cancers are always doing the right thing and whoever this air sign person is whether an Aquarius a Gemini or Libra you're going to overcome this situation justice is going to prevail and you're going to help this situation and there is um, message coming to you um, and this, these are positive message and it's about money and that sort of a situation okay now so I worked basically backwards uh, for you um, you guys most of you are going to be moving uh, most of you are going to be um, having um, the sense of new opportunities coming in your life um, love is going to be um, a year of if you're already in a long-term relationship this is going to be growing some of you if you're dealing with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra you're going to be removing this person out of your life so if you were married to this person or you had a long-term relationship or that sort of a thing you're going to be ending this and saying hey um you know I'm moving forward this is not for me for whatever reason it is I'm seeing a lot of you doing that in this year okay so as you look this is just a circle of things and the thing about it is that um, whatever injustice or whatever justice situation um, is as if secrets came out and um, information came out and there is going to be coming an end to certain situation in um, in your lives um, for the rest it is a year that is going to be shaking you from the core so remember after um, your birthday you begin the year to, um, 2018 and there is a lot of shaking that is going to be happening for you guys 
Okay. I want to wish you a wonderful, um, a happy birthday and a new beginning for the year 2018. Namaste until next time.